Okay, so we're here at the Nottingham Forest Football Stadium, and well, we wanted to find some excuse to use the stadium, so I thought, why not talk about the football itself? Now, it's a very special shape, but I, I tell you what, for the purpose of this video, I'm going to use this little uh, toy version, because it's a bit clearer to see. Now this is actually a special mathematical shape. It's called a truncated icosahedron. But what is an icosahedron? Let's start with that. So this prop, slightly less glamorous I'm afraid, it's, it's a homemade prop, I made it out of cardboard myself. But this is the icosahedron. It has 20 triangular faces and it looks like this. So now if I cut off the corners of this shape, we have 12 corners, if I cut them off, I will now make my football shape the truncated icosahedron. So the truncated icosahedron has 12 pentagon faces, here they are in black, and 20 hexagon faces, there they are in white, and they fit together. And this is your traditional football. This was used in professional games since the 1970s and has been more recently replaced with a modern ball which actually uses fewer panels. Now, there is an advantage though to using the old-fashioned ball because although it's slightly counterintuitive, the stitching around the ball makes it a bit more rough, it makes the surface a bit more rough and it actually makes it more aerodynamic. The, what they find with the modern balls, because they're smoother and are less rough, they are actually less aerodynamic. Oh. So they have to artificially add dimples and artificial grooves and stitching so that it will have the same sort of flight as the old-fashioned balls did. Yeah, so this shape was also used by an American architect called Bucky Fuller, who used to build domes in this shape. And it's him that they named the Bucky Ball after. The Bucky Ball is this shape. Yeah, you may have heard of the Bucky Ball. It's uh, also used in chemistry because it's a, it's a molecule of 60 carbon atoms, again, forming this shape, the truncated icosahedron. So in a Bucky Ball, we have these 60 atoms, which are the corners of this truncated icosahedron shape, making the same shape as this football makes. 